Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Trails to Azure. In the last part we finished up chapter 1, had a run in with Randy's uncle and cousin, Shirley and, uh, I can't remember what his, what his, what his name was, Shirley and somebody else. But uh, yeah, they're both some foreboding figures. We're in chapter 2, start off a new day, we got some stuff to do before we go any further. So, let's do some optional things and walk around the city. Nah, Landy. Oh, Nanda Arudo. Sana, Oto san no kotakido. Ahaha, so rekara. Betsuni kinisuro kota neze. Ano sekaija mezrashku mone hanashida. So reni, down on the ketatokini. Oreto yajiwa engo ki. I don't feel anything, but... I'm going to get a little bit. So... But... If you're looking for a while... You can get a little bit of a leader to be able to get a little bit of a leader. Oh... Sorry... I'm a little bit of a name. Haha... It's a little bit of a name. I'm a little bit of a name. I'm a little bit of a name. I'm a little bit of a name. お兄さん感慨深いぜあのなそのこういう時はなんとか力にならせてほしいんだ頼りないかもしれないけどそれロイド<笑>分かったいずれ話を聞いてもらうかもしれねえその時は頼むぜあいおあああれ何してるの二人とも忘れ物ごめんすぐ行くそんじゃぼちぼちお仕事を始めるとすっか Yes, there is. Actually, that's quite a significant boost. Let's go with that. Battle axe. Crusader. Well. Um, I think I'll do just Lloyd for the time being. I don't know, Mira. Okay. Give him the right gear and give him that. And in the meantime, I can give... Can I give him anything? Probably not. Uh, no. Alright, got Courage Emblem. Team Rush chance up, huh? Interesting. I'll give that to you. Considering you're like, my second powerhouse. Let's go get our Orbman settled. Upgraded. It's a lot. Let's finish up Lloyd's. I've got lots of stuff out to use, so that's good. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't look as expensive as it was before. Uh, you got two, so let's get you opened up. Alright, with that done, everyone's orbits are opened up, so let's augment. Yeah, he's gonna be my first focus. And that's it. That's all I can do. <laughs> I'm down and step with the again. Alright. Where does I put LEZP at now? Nice. Four, 486? 
I'll take that. Alright. Uh, there's a couple things I want to do, but first things first, before I even do anything, we're going to go do some fishing. Because we got to feed Cope. If you feed Cope in each chapter, you'll give a very... Like before, you'll get a very handy item. So let's fish. Coconut. Try. Bait. So I want dumplings. <sighs> okay, so I can't catch anything with dumplings. Here. A little earthworm. Got it. Mazu, mazu, got eel. So it. Yes, get to that. So it. I don't know how many fish I need in total. <laughs> Shit! I got away! God damn it. Alright. Ma, cool now, Monkana. Kind of fast. So it! Ma! Fish up a couple times. I'm not sure how many things the fish need in total. Ma, konna mon kana. Sore. Let's get good for now. If I need more fish, I can catch, come back and catch more. I probably won't do the fishing logs again this time around. Alright. While I'm here, is there anything around here that I need to check out? Doesn't look like it. So, uh... Let's take things off in the government district. Let's see. Let's go this way. Like stop over at the police station and see. Ooh, I can actually go up here now, huh? Orcus Tower, oh, Orcus Tower Plaza should be very busy today due to the preparations for tomorrow. Since we don't have any business here, that's not that too close. Come on, I want to see. Fine. All right, we need to talk to Rebecca. Hi, everyone. That thing you have with you it could be a fragment. Oh, that's right. We did find one that came in mind, didn't we? What is this thing? Um, you mean this? We thought it was something good when we got it, but until now we couldn't figure out a way to use it. Lloyd showed the refragment to Rebecca. My, as I thought. This is a quartz fragment that can repair damaged memory quartz. The people from forensics were looking for this. If you have that, it should be possible to analyze it part of the cult's terminal data. Then, we'll be able to believe the parts obscured by Joachim Gunter? Yes, only a portion of it, though, it seems. I think we'll have we'll have immediate results, so may I send this fragment to forensics? No, please go ahead. Then please wait a moment. Number one information, terminal data. About the cult, page one decrypted. If you obtain any other fragments, please bring them to me. Please, also feel free to ask whenever you'd like me to check any decrypted data. Let's see if no, at least I know what the fragment's doing. Alright. Okay. I am Young King Gunter. I praise the DG cult. Six years ago, the cult was almost completely destroyed due to the axe's many powers, braces, and braces included. However, for certain reasons, only I evaded harm and was able to escape safely to this land of origin. I survived in order to accomplish the cult's ambition thanks to the great D's guidance. For when the time comes, I've decided to record data in each terminal as, a mer as, a mer as material for writing new testaments. The rest of all speak of the cult's origins. 
do that, I will need to look back at the annoying history of the Sumeri Khan as followed. Approximately 1200 years ago, due to the ancient, colla ancient great collapse, order and an advanced civilization were lost, and the Dark Ages, where, where war and poverty ruled, were brought forth. Shit, I didn't finish reading it! Then the- God damn it. Then, the weary people committed a grave error. Uh... Something. This is probably because I'm not loaded up the batch file, maybe? By the words of imbeciles who had suddenly appeared, they ended up accepting the selfish order they had, inve they had invented. In other words, the foolish... Oh, wait a minute. The missing text. Hang on. I guess I have to load up the batch file. Let's see. Can we save right here and load up the batch file? Hold on. I will be right back. All right. Sorry about that. Now I've loaded up the batch file. So let's see if I can if I can read the data correctly this time. Ah. <sighs> So let's see if the text is gonna show this time. Kind of, no, it's still squares. So how is it decrypted? What was decrypted? No, nothing's decrypted. I'm so confused right now. So there's a bunch of squares. Nothing's decrypted, lady. Man, I loaded up the batch file for nothing. Alright. So much for that, huh? It's kind of curious, but nothing was decrypted. Maybe I had to wait? But decided I decided I don't get my immediate results. I'm so confused. Maybe I, maybe I had to wait. Alright. Let's check out the casino. There's something we can buy. Exchange. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, la, 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 la. This is what I want. So I need 500. Maybe, maybe 700. Tristan. Holy shit, 2000? So, in theory, how much would 2,000 things cost me? Probably a lot, right? That's all my money, essentially! I'll come back to this stuff later. I do want that fishing rod, though. I'll come back for the uh, for the uh, collectibles later. When I actually have more money that I know what to do with. What's going on, y'all? Make a pit stop in the dressing room. Where where is it? This one maybe? One of the aha! Car magazine, Orville Car Nobility. Sweet. Alright. Now I need to go talk to our buddy. Our buddy performers. How do I get on stage? I've never actually been on the stage. So I gotta figure out how to even get on the stage. Huh. I supposed to? Oh, is this one? This was blocked before. Haha. <laughs> oh, my efficient little bro. Hello. Sorry for interrupting. Everyone, hello. So you finally returned, Randy. No, that's our ratio for you. I'm so happy you're worried about me. 
Ah, uh, even so, I have to get to see you in Iliad in costume like this. I've seen them many times before, but I seriously never get tired of it. <laughs> Thanks. Ah, uh, hearing you say that again is a little embarrassing, though. Randy's eyes are always drawn to the most lewd thing around, you see. What was that for, Rosie? I was only saying it out of my own pure heart. Alright, we understand, so let's just ha leave it at that. <laughs> Sorry for making a fuss. By the way, are you practicing? I guess. We're doing the fine tuning for a performance tomorrow night. Tomorrow's guests aren't just guests, and I'm nervous. Yeah, I can't believe the heads of the state are going to be are going to visit our theater. Heads of state. That's right. That ca that came up in our plan planning meeting this morning. Well, they have been invited to the crossbar after all, and Arkansas performances are the best entertainment around. Yeah, that's probably what they were thinking. But I can't I can see why you'd be nervous. Yes, it seems like other members are nervous too. Now Ilya is the same as usual. What? You mean I mean worrying over every little thing won't solve anything, you know. No matter who's sitting in those seats, all I can do is my best for them. Goodness. You can always rely on who you can't read. And with a renewal performance too. Your energy amazes me every time. Renewal performance. Now that you mention it, Golden Sun Silver Moon is getting a renewal, isn't it? Yeah, that's a rumor going around. I think they're saying some bold arrangement will be added? Yes, that's right. Its, revi it's revision is, in a way, a challenge for ourselves, but we're aiming to bring the script and direction to a whole other level of perfection. Yes, once tomorrow's performance is over, we plan to focus on training for an approximately for for it for approximately one month. I see. So, when you said, looks like we're going to be busy when we met before, you must have been talking about this. <laughs> that's right. But to think we're going to join for a whole month. Seems like you put a lot of work into the new arrangement. But Golden Sun Silver Moon is already known as one of Arkansas's best performances ever. If you're going to improve it even more, I can't even imagine how the perfect final product will turn out. Yeah, seriously. I live through dance. I'm always searching for my best performance. In order to show our guests the time of their lives, we have to create an amazing performance. That is the duty of an Arkansas, and especially us artists. I wouldn't have any other way. That's our Ilya for you. Hmm. Can't wait to see it. Wait, can't wait until the renewed performance. It'll be officially announced before too long, so please be patient. I'm sure even those who saw the old version will be able to enjoy it. There's a little surprise in the cast. I'm sure you'll be shocked. Surprise, you say? Then I'll look forward to what's seeing what it is. What's the surprise? I want to know. I want to know now. All right, that's done. Let's head off to. I guess let's just go this way. Head up to West Street. I don't think there's anything here for us in the wet in the residential. So. Come to Tolly's and talk to this guy where you can buy that. Alright. Now, let's head off to the bakery. See what our buddy Oscar's up to. Oh, thanks for coming. I'm making new bread today as well. Here, try some. Thanks, Oscar. We'll savor it. Thanks for the free bread! Gotta love free! I'm just decorate my car. So I got body paint, pretty much, right? So I've got noble colors. Ooh. Um. Go with that. Kinda like that. Got the cat print on it and everything. The footprint, the paw print. Cat print. Alright, we need to go to East Street. Let's go see what got people are up to in the Bracer Guild. Michelle! Or not Michelle. Mit or not Michelle. Mitchell! I finally got the name right after so long. I'm surprised it took me so long to realize it was Mitchell. Oh yeah, I started playing that Palm Mobile game the other day. You guys want to go? <laughs> if you're free, let's have a match. Sweet. I'm assuming there's like some sort of achievement. Well, 
tro or trophy, I guess, since this is on the PSP, for uh, having beaten all the opponents. What are you guys up to? Ah, it's Lloyd and Friends. Oh, hello everyone. Hey Kia, looks like you're having fun. It's been a while since I've seen you, Shizuku. It's been a while. Wow, so this girl's a daughter of the Divine Blade of Wind, huh? <laughs> She's cute, just like I've heard. Just like I told you, right? That voice is... It's Noelle, isn't it? You helped me look for a present for my father before. What? You remember that? We weren't together very long. I'm happy. <laughs> Kia said you guys had some new members. And are these them? Wazi Hemisphere. Pleased to meet you. Yes, same here. Come on, you gotta introduce yourself, Suzuku. Ah, that's right then. I'm, um, I'm Kia's friend, Shizuku McLean. I understand you've been helping my father a great deal of support section. I would like to thank you for that once again. Well, you could say we're the ones being helped by Arios, though. Hmm, I guess you could say that. That's not true. In that incident earlier, you all helped everyone a lot. This kid is always on the ball, you know. Hey, are you guys gonna play with Sh Kia and Shizuku too? <laughs> no. Oh shit. I missed it. I just wait for the string to catch up. Uh, no, because Shizuku's here. I just thought we'd ch chime in. Or something like that. We've got work to do, but play with Shizuku for us as much as you like today, okay? Yeah, got it. Um, do your best with your work, everyone. Oh, that's just nice. Alright. Let's check out the the hard ass Imperial Fishing Club. Don't screw with us. How foolish do you need to make us look like until you're satisfied? What the? A coral? Did something happen again? Hey everyone, is something wrong? Yes, Lloyd, you arrived at the right, at the right time. Remember, Lloyd, please listen to this. The truth is, his comrades have appeared at fi various fishing points outside the city. They suddenly blurted out that they have monopolized those places. Monopolizing the fishing points? Yes, he said that those outside the Imperial Fishing Club can't fish in those places. Yeah, I ignored him and forced my way in, but when I did that, I was obstructed by having my line snapped. That's awful. Excuse me, why can't you get all, get all, get all along? all get along. I think that, that makes no sense. Get all along. I think, I think it's supposed to be the, the other way around. <laughs> That's because the Fisherman's Guild is a group of foolish amateurs. Even just seeing them moving around in front of me, in front of us, in front of we, a supreme professional group, is an eyesore. God damn it, I got to call. Whew. What's wrong with being amateurs? Enjoying fishing has nothing to do with being pros or amateurs. Yeah, I know that you guys have obtained results in many tournaments, but... There are some skilled anglers among our number as well. I wish you wouldn't underestimate us. Oh? Like the branch manager says, I had to relinquish my title, but don't take my don't take a master fisherman lightly. <laughs> okay. Interesting. I didn't expect to hear such words from you. If you insist, then... Why don't you t undertake the angler's duels? A angler's duels? Are you crazy? Um, what are these angler duels? Well, like the name says, they're battles conducted through fishing. A match, a match called an angler duel has an absolute meaning to an angler. Yes, the angler's pride and honor. They're their earnest matches performed by betting all things material and spiritual. I've never done one, but... I heard of stories of anglers who lost their entire fortune by losing in those matches. In other words, you have to win at all costs for those kinds of battles. Is that so? That's some crazy stuff. So, what are the rules? Let's see. It is my four comrades and I that have come to co cross spell. If even one of you challenges and defeats all five of us, it'll be your victory. What do you say? You're free to challenge us however many times you'd like, but until you win the duels, you'll overlook our whims. Of course, the whims will be limited to fishing. And if we win? Hmm, it's a remote possibility that a miracle happens, but a man could dream, am I right? 
Well, by defeating each of us, we will of course set free the corresponding fishing points. And if you manage to defeat all five of us, we will completely withdraw from Crossbell. And we'll head over this office too, natu too naturally. Furthermore, I'll listen to a single one of your orders, whatever it is. Huh? For real? <laughs> but can we really trust you? It seems that even if you want, they really won, there's no guarantee you'd keep your promise. No. Like Pierce said earlier, the result of an angler deals an absolute to an, ang to an angler. Then, no matter what our attitude towards fishing is, it's certain these guys have more pride as anglers than our average fishermen. That, I think it's safe to say that them breaking their promises is out of the question. I see. So that's how it is. Selden, contrary to expectations, even you understand. So, what do you want to do? Do you want to try to challenge us? Alright, we'll challenge you. <laughs> as you wish. Are you sure, branch manager? If we don't win, we'll have to abide to their whims forever, no? But on the contrary, we can challenge them as many times as we want. This being the case, frankly, don't you think it'll be an easy win? No matter how strong they are, no, no one can keep winning the fan fishing forever. Indeed, I get that feeling. Here's you all haven't yet unlocked the meaning of fishing. Well, whatever. Incidentally, I'll, I'll only allow one who has defeated all four comrades to challenge me. In addition, I will indicate reasonable qualifications for challenging each of them too. As one, as one might, once as one might can expect, we don't have time to face people without a certain level of skills. Please understand that point. Yes, I understand. Branch manager. Well, if there's nothing else you don't understand, you can ask Silent, the receptionist, later. I wonder if you'll ever really be able to be suitable for the Elite Four, the pride of our Imperial Fishing Club. Angler duels. Things have gotten serious. But it'll be an easy win. Just one of us four needs to beat that Lake Lord completely. Mm -mm. I honestly don't think I have what it takes to beat him. The other thing that worries me is his Elite Four. There's also the limitless re-entry, re 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 retry rule. But when sooner or later, of course. However, at the very least, I don't think beating them will be as easy as Copen says. According to rumors, each of them has a real strength greater than that of our so-called master fisherman. Is that so? <sighs> As I thought, it'll be impossible for me. I see. Things have gotten interesting. Well, let's return to our new branch for now and hold a strategy meeting. New branch, you say? Oh, I didn't tell you about it yet, Lloyd. Actually, Branch Master Selden has found a building on the East Street, East Crossville Highway for our new office. Although, it's a boat rental shed that hasn't been used since it was abandoned several years ago. It's cramped, worn out, and crumbling, but it's be because it's near the river we can even fish, so it's quite nice, right? Yeah, I feel like it's an ideal place for a fresh start. You should see the sign when you come close to the Tongram Gate area at the crossroads of East Crossville Highway. Follow it, and it's a little further south. If you have time, please come visit us, Member Lloyd. Yes, I understand. Well then, Member Lloyd, I plan to do something about the angler duels before long. However, since our members are few, we can all, you can use all the help we can get. I'm counting on you as well, Member Lloyd. Right. I don't want to be I don't want to be unable to fish my favorite spots either. I'll support as much as I can. <laughs> I won't lose either. Then we'll take our leave here. All right then. Good luck. Yes. The same to you all. To all of you. And off they go. Hmm. Lloyd seems happy for some reason. Fishing, huh? I don't get it myself, but there are a lot of people who are passionate about it. I know. It's a great pastime. Myself? No, not really. Alright. Let's go to downtown. Uh, oh, what do we have here? What's Reese up to? I see. I'll go see Anna then. The woman was a witch, so surely she know Ron's location. He followed the road to Anna's hut. Suddenly, Mark's ears heard the piercing cry of a monster. So exciting. And then? And then? Huh? Let's have lunch early. You brought bread, right? <laughs> Let's eat it secretly. Reese. Looks like she's here for Sunday school. She's reading them a fairy tale, huh? It's a heartwarming scene, somehow. That's nice. 
Let's go see what our guys over at Ignis are doing. Koki? That story's real, huh? Yeah, that's what the kids said, but I don't believe it. No, I can't believe it. For Wall to get beat like that? Are they talking about the fight on that rainy day? Yeah, must be. You! What kind of face is that? Wazzy. <laughs> you talking to me? Fine, bring that face. I'll turn it right back at you. Hey! Luganov, stop! If we fight those kids here, it'll make Wall, Wall look bad. And it's not what Wall would have wanted. Shit. I don't know why you're here. We don't feel like fighting, so get out of here, okay? But if you're here to pick a fight, that's a different story. No, we had no intent, such intentions. <clears throat> We're bothering you, huh? Let's go, everyone. Alright. Alright. We feel very welcome there. Okay. Let's get out of here and make our way to the back alley. It's the last place we need to check out. This guy's car. Alright. Uh, where am I going? What's in here? Oh, it's a back door. Hello, I'm behind the counter. What are you gonna do? Ooh. Customers allow allow us to recommend bought bellberry juice to soothe your throats. Cool. You guys, uh, I don't think it's safe leaving your back door open. I'm just saying right now. It's probably not a good idea. Alright. Um. Milda, what do you have to sell? So you still sell it? Oh my god, 80,000 is more expensive than last time! Are you serious? Oh yes, yeah, so I recently started reading a serial novel series. A serial novel series, but. Interesting things are interesting, but it just didn't match my taste, you see? Since you're here, I think I'll force on you guys. Well, thanks. Thanks for that. Who said I wanted this? Alright. What's going on down here? Oh, you. Oh, if it isn't Captain Randolph. <laughs> You're here again today. The Red Constellation, this Red Constellation Jagger. Looks like Randy knows him. Sax. Looks like your new HQ is quite comfy, huh? <laughs> Thank goodness it is. The Entertainment District Branch of New Way Blanc is nearby too, so it's quite convenient to use. He always... He did a good job as always. Uncle is sure that I'm here today, aren't either? Yeah. Boss and the missus went out for business today as well. If you have a message for them, I'll tell them. How about it? No. Sorry to bother you. Let's go, Lloyd. R right. Thanks for all your hard work. <laughs> See you soon, Captain. <laughs> Seems they're pretending to be out again. Again, you say? Did you recently visit recently? He said he had something to talk about, but that was the last I've heard of him. Anyway, it appears that even if I could try to meet him, he's got no intention of showing up. Hmm, he might contact you somehow before long. But if that's the case, we can only inquire steadily about the Red Constellation. Yeah, let's try visiting various places while taking care of our support requests. That's just nice. It's giving him the cold shoulder. Alright. I think I'm done with the stuff in the city, so... We gotta make a trip over to Maine's for something. Yes. Let's hop in our fancy new no car. Can I go? Uh. Okay, so I can go to Tongram. I can go to Armorica. I can go to Maine's. I can go to Belgar. I can go everywhere. Nice. Oh, I can even go here too. Ooh, I didn't know that. But I can't go there, huh? Alright, so I need to go to Mains. 
さあ行くぞ到着だWhat were those guys up to? Well, maybe we shouldn't overthink it. They did help us out. Yes, but we still don't know who the, that criminal was. Who the criminal was? An abundance of caution is necessary here. Um, Mary Big, Mr. Bixon, Gantz, hello. Oh, it's you guys. Sorry, we were just talking about the old mine incident, perhaps. Ah, uh, well, several CGI patrols came through in relation to the incident the other day, but. We still have no idea regarding both the criminal who set the explosives and the phenomenon inside the tunnels. For now, we installed a new gate to replace the broken one and sealed it good and proper. I guess we won't have to worry about people wandering inside for the time being. It's just, there's something else that has me, that has me worried. You see, a strange group of group, of, group appeared in Mainz the other day. They brought some huge septium crystals for they bought some huge septium crystals for a huge sum. A strange group. How should I put it? Well, anyway, they had a unique air about them. It seemed like a well-built, red-headed, middle-aged man was their leader. Actually, it was sort of exactly like the hair of Randy here, come to think of it. That's... Red Constellation? Did they do anything besides that Septian purchase? No, nothing suspicious. But they didn't look like traitors. We don't know who they destroyed the old gate. Mine gates, so they had me worried is all. Based on what Randy said earlier, it seems like they were the ones who set the explosives. Well, we have no definitive proof, so we shouldn't say anything. But, I wonder what that Jager Corps is planning on doing with those Septium Crystals. Crimson Co. Crim... That they run... Crimson Co. Wait, what? That they run as... as that they run has... Connect, uh, uh, this, this translation. The Crimson Co. that they run has connections to a lot of good-for-nothing traders. Those large crystals, they're probably earning, them, earning some side money from selling them on the black market. I see. Hmm, that's right. Maybe I should give it to you guys. Hand it over, Gantz. Yeah, I got it. Here, take it. Oh, cool. This is, the, this is the for the old mine. Yeah, spare key, so to speak. Um, are you sure? We're outsiders, after all. I can trust you guys. If there's anything, any, if there's ever anything you need to investigate, please be our guest. Just in case we rebuilt the ladder, so it'll come easier. It'll be easier to come and go. Thanks. We'll use it carefully. That's nice. I got free access. All right. Let's yes. check out. Um, let's go check out the mo moon tunnel. I skipped this place before, so... Let's see what this place has to offer now. I just gotta find... Oh, I went too far. No! I know how I'm missing this Alright, I need to go back down here. Down and around. Oh, chest. Septium! Or oh, Septium Sepeth! Alright. Mm. Have I scanned these guys before? I have not. いくぞ。俺の番だ。え、よ。ま、こんなもんかね。I have a lot of XP. Holy shit. 200. Oh, they ran away like cowards. Palm. 
These guys get fairly hard, but then it gives a level, six, uh, a level 62, so a little higher than us. Thanks for that. Some nice XP there, so might pay, might pay to level up here a little bit. Should heal before I get into another fight. Probably. Seems like the smart thing to do, right? Actually, hold on. I upgraded my slots so I have I can actually equip shit. All right. Um, let's give you, uh, Randy, let's upgrade your attack. Um, um, seals, I don't really want seal. I never view seal. Let's go with impede. Uh, you will get. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. I guess I can get rid of this for a sh This will give me blue drop and Tira. So, yes, let's do that. Uh, art range. That could be good for you, especially for breaths. But what am I going to replace it with? Um. I think I'll just leave it as is for the time being. Actually, I get Saint, I get Stone Spike. I'll give that to you. Randy, I guess I'll give. You don't get anything new out of that, do you? Uh, I'll give that to Lloyd. out of it. Oh. Look at this mess. Oh. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's heal up. What a new range to test. <laughs> Those worms give a lot of XP, so it might be worth leveling here. Ooh, a bamboo rod. And rune robe. Absolutely useless to me. Uh, I'll give it to you for the time being, I guess. Hey, go! Shoot, say, go! That was easy. Level up! Alright, let's blind him. I'm assuming I'll be able to blind him, right? No? What? 
行きます。はい。よしえはいさてとエニグマよっそっかやっありがとう行くぜクラッシュボーン 30% ブラインドユーウズオンウズプレマチオンウズギャランティーウンアイディブフォーウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオンウズオ Can't complain. Oh, still blocked off. Authorized personnel only. So I can't actually go over there, huh? Ah, I see a treasure chest over there in the distance. Because I can't get it. I'll be back. Alright. Might come back here and level off screen a little bit. I can't. Can't complain about that XP. I just wish there was more of those enemies around. Alright. l Let's use the Don't car. Go, go, go. Take a trip over to Belgard. Let's go! This is Belgar Gate, huh? Yeah, it's the base It's base of the Guardian Force unit that protects Crossbell's border with the Empire. I told you about her before, but the skip this place is under the skilled command of Commander Sonia Bales. <laughs> I've never met her in person, but she seems like quite the cool, quite the cool, cool beauty. She's definitely a babe, but she's one scary la lady. I think the previous commander was, in, was given a dishonorable discharge after that cult incident scandal. We still have no idea who that person was. We never even met him.、So、Commander Sonia was more skilled than, from, than him from the start. That guy was a good for nothing who pushed work onto his subordinates. He himself only entertained degenitaries. I don't know if that, that, that's, probably not, that's still not how you pronounce it, probably. In a way, that for you, the appeal day stream we had to do was his fault, too. He was persuaded by the mastermind. And dose the truth of the drug. About that. How did the rehabilitation train go? It was great. All troops are back to normal. But that commander is a slave driver. I'm completely exhausted. Oh, right. I thought about doing it during rehabilitation tra training, but Morelia should have gotten her, pr her promotion by now. Morelia is the officer lady we met before, right? Yeah, it looks like they finally recognized her achievements. Since we're here, I was thinking of teasing her about it. We should congratulate her instead. But anyway, we should also check in with Commander Sonia. In that case, let's head to the Commander's room on the second floor. She may be busy with the trade conference preparations, though. Right, let's head there. Let's not head there, because I got stuff to do first. Come back out to the highway. Down here. This is the one part of the highway I did not get to get to. One XP. That's lovely.、Uh, Ace it! No. No. Not today. Not ever. What's on the ground? Time, Sabbath. Sepeth all around. Shit. Now they run away! <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> Fucking dog! Kinda curious to see if that shiny palm's here, so I'll give her like one. one deal. One. Oh, the chest. Sleep! That dog's chasing me hard. No. No shiny palm. 
Not interested. No, the dog! Well, XP is not gonna get me anywhere. Okay. Now I came from those things. Now. Let's see what Morelli's doing. First off, can I buy anything here? Uh, no. Alright, fine, Morelli. Hello, Morelli. Alright, it's the support section. Huh, and stupid... <clears throat> Randy, now, how have you been? <laughs> Morelli. He tried to say it, but... I know how you really feel. You've been feeling quite lonely since I went back to the support section, right? Don't go, Randy. Don't go, Randy, stay with me, stuff like that, right? Don't... Uh, why didn't I ever say anything of the sort? D damn big stupid Randy. <laughs> they always have such a good relationship. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing well, Warrant Officer Morelli. By the way, I heard you were promoted. Congratulations. <clears throat> yes. To be honest, it's more than I deserve. Of all things, I led the of all the of all the of all things, I led the assault on IBC during the cult incident. That was a grave error. You were dosed with that strange drug and manipulated. You don't have anything to worry about. Yes, I understand it was with, it with my head, but I can't forgive myself. Man, always a stubborn one, aren't you? You did your best to take command, even under that idiotic former commander. Isn't that this is exactly what you deserve? Accepting it just me just accepting it is just good manners toward the commander. What can I say? I got serious all of a sudden. <laughs> I'm always serious. Yeah, you're right. I've decided to accept it. Thanks, Randy. Huh? You say something? Never mind. Well, that's nice. Alright. Sonia! What's going on here? We haven't seen you in a while. Good morning, Commander Sonia. Oh, same to you, Sergeant Sergeant Major Noel. Seem to be doing well with your assignment at the special support section. Yes, there's so much to learn. Ah, so this is the Guardian Forces Commander, Sonia Bales. A capable commanding officer of the CGF. Quite the brave woman, don't you think? Yeah, she's assisted us quite a bit in the past. Long time no see, Commander. And congratulations on your promotion. Thank you. And it's nice to see you as well. Yeah, I've been tied up with the trade conference they carry so much lately that I had no opportunity to visit you all. I figured you were busy. Yes, I've been checking the security perimeter daily with my unit. We have to be ready for anything you see. Well, the international VIPs are coming tomorrow, after all. It's only natural you'd be doing that. Sorry to disturb you when you're so busy, Commander. Actually, your timing is perfect. There's something I wanted to tell all of you. Huh? Yesterday, a certain group came to visit Belgard Gate. It was a red constellation. One of the strongest and most fearsome Jaeger Corps in Zemuria. What? They came here too? Regarding red constellation, they say you're directly connected to them, Randy. Accordingly, I thought I should convey this eyewitness report to you all directly. What did they do here? According to the CGF member who spotted them, they didn't do anything in particular that stood out. After arriving, they relaxed for a while at the mess hall. They then met a traitor from the Empire and let the gate together. Hmm. They met an Imperial traitor. Merchant, huh? I wonder if they had any connection with, to the Crimson and Co. Ah, uh, that's the Shell Company Red Constellation is using for fundraising. Seems likely, but even so, coming here directly it was quite bold. The CGF is a security organization. I think that they came right into the midst of the elites who defend the Imperial border zone. Maybe they haven't done anything in Crossville yet. There's no proof it was them behind the old mine case of the other day either. Maybe they've no reason to use stealth. You don't run a high class club out in the open like that without some thick skin. Commander Sonia, thanks for the info. No need to thank me. I've compelled, I'm compelled to say that the Red Constellation Jaeger Corps will require special attention with respect to trade conference security. 
If you learn anything, contact the CGF as well. Understood. We'll keep an eye out for them. That's nice. I don't think we've ever tangled with Red Constellation before. I know we've, I know, I know we've tangled with Zephyr, but I don't think we've ever messed with anyone from, from uh, from the uh, Red Constellation. Ooh. Let's make them, make, make them at home soup specials. Milk pot, milk pottage. Wonderful. All right. Uh, around here. What is out here? Uh, does this loop around? Oh no, oh hello. Snapper barrel. I'm gonna give that to Ellie. Oh no, I can't. <gasps> Actually I can, it gives her better range. Let's do it. And then, then I can give, maybe this, I can give this to, yes. What are you doing over here? Valley really is great. If you fall, you won't survive. How thrilling. Yeah, I know. I don't know about that. Alright. I think that's all the optional stuff we can do. Uh, yes. That's all we can do. I can come back for the... Decoration items later on in the future. Yes, go. So, uh, actually, I gotta go back to crossbow. Don't go any go, can I? Sir, go. All right, I am going to end it here, and when we come back, we will check out. These support requests that we gotta do. We got four to handle, so we'll get them done next time. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you then. Later.